Hi, my name's Alex. I'm one of the founders of Dot Mobile. For the past four weeks or so, we've all been working from home, and in some ways that's been very productive. We've focused a lot on the application we're building. Uh, in other ways, though, it's made us very uh, quiet online. So uh, I thought today I would try something different. I took over my fiance's work from home space, uh, moved some plants out of the way, and now it's just a screen recorder, a camera, and me. And I'm going to give you a sneak peek of our app. So let's uh, load it up. What you'll see is that similar to our website, uh, all you have to do is choose Google or Facebook if you want to connect with your social account, uh, or you can use email to sign up. So let's do that. We'll use email. Let's do good old contact us. And we'll pick our password. And there we go, we're in. This is the home screen. It has a lot of information from different places throughout the app. So here are some cards about uh, the marketplace. Uh, there's some content from outside the app. So maybe we'll send you some articles that would be worth reading or some of our own blog posts. Uh, statistics from connectivity. Uh, and then up here is a to-do list. Let's take the first item on there and customize our avatar. Uh, we've just got some default ones here. Let's pick this blue phone. And there we go, checked it off my list and my uh, profile pictures changed. Uh, rather than going through the whole list, let's look at some other features in the app. We'll start by going through the icons at the bottom. The most left one is service, and this is for wireless service. Uh, we're still building that part. So today uh, you can just read about what we're building and you can kind of you know, swipe through and get a rough idea of what it is we'll be delivering. The next icon is marketplace. This is designed for your phone, and so everything in here is, uh, is really designed to be uh, something that complements your device. Uh, but we wanted to make that easier, so we'll let you do it for your specific phone. So let's go into the profile again by choosing Detect Now, pick my phone, and here we go. Uh, now the marketplace has been filtered to only show me products that are uh, compatible with the device. I'm going to pick one of them. Let's go with this uh, screen protector. I'm going to add it to my cart. Uh, and here we go. I've got uh, just a quick way to add my shipping address, choose a payment method, and then I can have it uh, delivered straight to my door. Not going to do that right now though. Uh, instead, what we're going to do is go to the next icon, which is connectivity. Uh, and what you'll see here is a, a screen that's um, maybe not as pretty as some of the others yet. It's uh, more in progress. Uh, but what we're happy to announce is that we've built some of the background features and the backend functionality already. Um, so you've got your basic speed test in here, but we wanted to do something uh, more uh, and that used less data. So we've uh, come up with these background scans. They do a ping and they measure all the network conditions at that time. Your phone's already doing it, so we just kind of get a snapshot of it. Uh, and then with that snapshot, we can get them kind of with relative frequency from all of our members. And then we can crunch all that data and give everybody insights back. So let's go to the final screen, uh, which is our support screen. Right now it is just DotBot, which is our connectivity, sorry. Right now it's just DotBot, which is our chatbot. Uh, and let's ask it a question. We've been trying to give it some personality. So. Okay, uh, so um, for those of you who've been following along, this is a little bit of an Easter egg for us, uh, and it's not a Star Wars reference. Um, support will have more features in it beyond the chatbot, and the chatbot will eventually be able to reach into your account and give you information about, say, your orders or your service or your profile, um, and we'll have other ways for you to get support as well in there. Um, so that's it. Here's our app. And uh, you know, some of our members uh, are actually already, uh, already downloading the early access for it. Uh, if you're not one of those lucky few, uh, or you want to participate in some way, head on over to our website and go to the Build It page. Uh, there you'll see all the other features we're building, and you'll be able to vote on them and provide feedback and ideas. So uh, hope to see you there.